thank you. How are you? I'm amazing too. Awesome. Take it away. Give Veronica the respect. Yeah. Hello, everybody. How's everybody doing? I don't know if all of you noticed, but that lovely Britney Spears impersonator was my husband, Bill. So this was his first time on stage in drag. Yeah! Yeah! I think it might not be his last. Yes! <laughs> so the reason I chose him, I think probably goes without saying for most of you that know us and know that he's there with me by my side always when I can't bend over and snap my shoes and stuff. And I tell you what, I've learned how to do that by myself a little bit better through this competition. But Bill is, he's my teammate. We're, we're partners, we're, we face everything together. Not only drag, we face the stuff that he does with his theater work, and we face life together. We don't, we're in it for the long haul, that's it. It's, it's the end of the days for us, and he'll be by my side. So that's why he's here. And he's helped me become a better person, a better performer, a better everything. He pushes me. And that kind of brings me to the reasons why I feel that I deserve to win this competition as well. Um, to kind of digress, I'm going to tell you a little bit about myself, um, since I have the opportunity. Um, when I was in my 20s, which was a long time ago, and I know some of you know that because I talk about how old I am all the time. And I am. I'm in my 40s. And when I was in my 20s, I was a lost, lost, lost kid. I went through some really dark times, and it was really about finding myself and being confident in who I was and being happy with who I was. And I think that us in the LGBTQ community, a lot of us know what that's like. And it took a long fight and a long road, and I'm here because I love myself. And it took me a long time to get here. Um, I probably would have been doing this in my 20s had I been in a different place. But I came to that place later in my life, and here I am now, living out these dreams that I had when I was younger. You know, I got here through a lot of love and support, a lot of work, and a wonderful support of loving mother, who's been here every week. And this part is, this part is one. I feel it. And I feel that the growth that I've had as a person has been enhanced by this competition and as a performer. Um, I started off this competition scared of this thing right here, the microphone, and that changed. I was scared of doing things on spontaneously in drag. I had to plan everything, and now I love being out here, and I love performing, and this has been the best experience, and I feel that the other reason I deserve it is I've been on the top the whole time. I've been consistent and working hard and bringing the best me every week. Uh, thank you. Thank you. But no matter what happens, I, this has been the most amazing experience. Thank you to the judges and to Batty and to Bradley and to Bill and all, you, all the girls here. It's been a great experience. I'm ready to do this. I want to be the next Grand Rapids Drag Race for season yeah! 